All right, today we have a new bag to review. Um, this is another Viking Cycles bag, and this is the Viking Aero Medium Expandable Motorcycle Sissy Bar bag. Um, it's a mouthful, but so as you can see in the back here, it's got a little Velcro ability to expand so you can put any various size sissy bar through here to secure this and then you can strap that down as tight as you need or as tight as you want. I don't actually have a sissy bar on my bike as you can see. Uh, the reason I have this bag for myself personally is I like to bungee net stuff onto the tail after I take the cowl off um, and this is just the right size that I can still do that obviously without the cowl and with the right bungees and straps, it ties down great. Um, the nice thing about this bag is there is a lot of space. It says medium bag, expandable, but it's big. It's great in a good way. Um, you've got extra little quick access pockets here on the side and they have a lot of room in them and they expand too. You can see they pop out and close that back up got extra places you can strap and buckle things onto and clip onto on the sides not just on the top and the back and there's four of those and then let's go ahead and undo these these clips by the way heavy duty like thick clips and they don't feel like they're gonna shatter or break if you grab them too hard or anything which is good because you know you have a tendency to have like buckle failure before strap failure on a lot of luggage with motorcycle stuff so that's great um, those straps are set up so you can strap them up and over here this way. You can go backwards this other direction and connect them to the back here. There's a lot of extra setups so you can, you can buckle them all sorts of different directions. See, even over the sides like this, you can bring them up over. And so there's, it's a lot of um, options, which for luggage, everyone's bike di differs a little bit. So I think that's important. Let's get this top off. All right, so here is it open with the top off. Now there's actually an additional bag that comes with it that you can attach to the top as well. But this space, look at, look at this space. Like there is so much room in here. See that? I don't know if you can see that, but I can see that. And that's enough for at least a good weekend trip, if not like a whole week, depending on how light you, you pack. I pack pretty light. Um, when I want to, when I want to, and so I can, I can get away with a lot. Now let's see if we can't. Here's the expandable zipper. You unzip it, kind of like some of those luggages you see for flights and travel. You can sit here and you unzip the back, or like a tank bag. Sometimes tank bags have that same, that same expanding feature, which is good. It's a luggage thing. And we all know that sometimes you just need that little extra room. So now that that's done and unzipped there, you can expand it all the way. Look at how fat that is. Look at that. Look at how much it more than doubles the size of this bag almost. About double. It looks like it about doubles it. Because not up top, of course, because of the angle, but it almost makes it look like a nice fat backpack, which is pretty cool. Um, that's a lot of space. That is a lot of space. Oh yeah, it does expand up top too. That is a big bag, guys. Look at this. This medium bag is awesome. Um, but it does come packed down, which is great. So yeah, that's like two weeks worth of luggage space right there. That's a lot. And this bag is a nice leather to it. Um, I wouldn't say waterproof. No one likes to say waterproof. But based off of the, the material and the feeling of the liner, I would say you would be pretty safe riding through without even a cover over this in any medium to light rainstorm, um, especially since it's gonna be behind you. But still, you would, this is a lot of stuff to be able to have dry after a rainstorm on a bike. A lot of moto trips, you find yourself caught in unsuspecting rain, half your gear or most of your gear is going to be wet most of the time. So having good, like wet luggage that is good without a cover is, is very valuable, very, very valuable. So let's put this aside and take a look at this quick little bag here as well. It's almost like a little duffel bag. 
Um, the nice thing about this is sometimes you don't want to have to unstrap everything from your bike. You know, you've got all your luggage buckled on and it's secure and you don't want to fuss with it because you're only stopping, say, for lunch or for the night and you just don't want to have to re redo everything, which personally I actually would, I like to just take it all off because I don't like leaving my stuff on my bike, but not everyone does. So you can always put your most valuable valuables in here um, and ha be able to quick release, pull this out of the bag, or if you've got strapped on top, you know, you've got a nice little handle and you just take it. And there is a cover, however, for this bag. So light rains, probably good. You don't even have to worry about the cover or stop and pull it off. It's going to rain heavy. There is a cover for it. So this cover is really nice material. Like you can feel the quality of the material. Um, I'm pretty impressed with this because you get some of these rain covers and they feel like thinner than, than a windbreaker that could this, that you could pull apart, you know, it feels really thin. And you can, you can see the liner, it's a very, very um, water repellent type of a liner. It's got a nice elastic around the end of it, so you get it over there and you can use the elastic to help keep it cinched on. And you can also cinch it on even tighter. So that's a pretty nice bag right there for the waterproof. I'm gonna move this over to the side. And additional straps. These straps have uh, like padded shoulder, so you could always attach these to your bag in many places. You saw all the buckles, many, many places, and be able to carry your bag without having to like haul, 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 and lug it. Um, and then extra straps of just the regular nature. So guys, this bag is great. It's huge. It's got a lot of potential, a lot of storage space. And I'm pretty excited because I've got a bunch of new camping gear and I intend to go moto camping here very shortly. And this is the bag that's coming with me. Um, again, this is the Viking Cycles. Let me look at the name. Uh, it is the Viking Cycle Aero. Here it is. It is called Viking Aero medium expandable motorcycle sissy bar bags. I'll put a link in the description. You can go check it out yourself. Very affordable, very nice quality bag for what you get. It's, this is a great bag. So I'm pretty excited. Let's go camping.